Okay, um, question five, you're presented with uh, two vectors, u and v. u is 5, 1, minus 1, and v is 3, minus 8, 6, and we're asked to get u dot v. Okay, um, the dot product, if you look at your formula sheet, just means that you multiply these two, these two, and the bottom ones together, and add them. 5 times 3 is 15, 1 times minus 8 is minus 8, Minus 1 times 6 is minus 6. 15 take 8, take 6, gives you 1. Part B, you're presented with uh, a diagram with vectors u and w pulling away from a point and with an angle of pi over 3. Let's just think about pi over 3 first of all. Pi radians is 180, divide that by 3 is 60. So for those of you who like using degrees, there we have it there. OK, let's go back to the formula sheet. u dot w is the size of u times the size of w times the cosine of the angle in between pi over 3, which is 60. Now we're told what the length of w is. It's actually root 3. So all we actually need to do is get the length of vector u. Well, u is 5, 1, minus 1. So the length of a vector from nat 5, you square them, add them, root them. 5 squared plus 1 squared plus minus 1 squared. That gives you 27, so the size of u is the root of 27. OK, let's put these into the formula for u dot w. Root 27 times root 3 times cos of 60. Now you have to remember that from your table of exact values. Now 3 27s is 81 and the cosine of 60 is a half. The root of 81 is 9 times a half is four and a half. There we have it.